Sports was everything with Crypto Marie Loco and International. Feminist group demands firing over Caitlin Clark ESPN controversy. A feminist group is demanding a firing at ESPN over the Caitlin Clark controversy. ESPN host Pat McCarthy referred to Clark as a white explosive during his show last week. McCarthy has since apologized. I shouldn't have used um right explicit as a descriptor of caitlin clark no matter the context even if we are talking about race being a reason for some of the stuff happening i have way too much respect for her and women to pour that into the universe he said and let me tell you something guys the hypocrite behind the whole thing is real i have heard and seen black women being called out of their name all the time the b word is like a no big deal they call us that whether you are professional we are whether you are a regular person they call us that everywhere you go no feminist group ever came out to protect us to support us to say you should not say that somebody need to be fired nobody heard it they don't care what they call black women and i'm sure andrew reese been calling out her out of her name all the time nobody said anything about it so why are you guys going to be so hypocrite feminist group coming out of nowhere to support that because it's Kaylin clark what's wrong with america why you cover your ear for one group of people and the other group you all awake and about to have a man losing his job and i hope espn don't listen to that crap because those feminist group seems to have nothing to worry about they need to find something else to worry about seriously as a woman myself i have been called out of my name all the time Nobody said anything about it. Oh, give me a break. Pat said, my intention when saying it were complimentary, just like the entire segment. But a lot of folks are saying that it certainly wasn't at all. That's 100% on me. And for that, I apologize. I have sent an apology to Caitlin as well. Everything else I said still all facts. But a feminist group is still calling for his firing they have nothing to do i wonder if those people have husband wife kids to worry about because there always be these crazy groups come out, coming out of nowhere act like oh we are the people we represent the woman why don't you come represent black and white women why you only represent white women the hypocrite behind the whole thing is real that's that cultural cancel thing i have a problem with it because it's only benefited one group of people enough with that crap pat mccaffrey's apology for his racist and sexist comments about caitlin clark in order wnba <sighs> players is insufficient the simple reality is that even if mccaffrey meant what he said as a compliment he should know that referring to any professional athlete with a misogynistic or racial epithet is no, never a compliment and shouldn't be done the group ultraviolet said in a statement give me a break but it's about more than just the specific words he chose to describe caitlin clark his entire segment segment which he has said he stands behind and doesn't apologize for was used to downplay the contributions of other wnba rookies including injuries and perpetrated a dangerous narrative rooted in misogynist misogynoir that the wnba a league dominated by black women for years is being saved by clark when both profits and viewership have been on the rise prior to the start of this season again guys i feel like Kaylin Clark did not ask for all this attention that is going towards her. And it is unfortunate we have people coming from every background, don't have nothing to worry about, nothing to care for, but coming to give their opinion on what should be done, what should not be done. Because the men called a young lady out of her name once or twice, he deserved to lose millions of dollars as his income doing what he does best at ESPN. But then we have people out there killing, destroying, 
and what those group got to say about that gun control is another one why don't you guys come out because we, we send our kids to school and you don't know if they're gonna come home alive or dead why don't you guys say something about it? you're gonna worry about a word a woman being called out of when black women have been calling out of their name all the time every day in a daily basis in minutes second give me a break and find something more productive to do with your time i would ask feminine group because you have really you have nothing to do with your time leave the man alone he apologized already and i don't think you should be asking for him to get fired for using a word that they use towards black women every goddamn day thank you for watching and subscribe bye